How is Ali going? It's the final year of university, right? Yeah, it is. Unless she does a master's. She's doing really well. One of her professors asked her to join in the science research project that the university's doing. Very good. You must be real proud of her. Can you even afford for her to do a master's? And what's this science research project? What's this about? I don't know. She didn't say. She's always in a rush, you know? But she's going to be home for Eid. So I guess I'll find out then. Well, let's hope. Researching skills are a lot better than that last move. How is work going? Good. If all goes well, and the company just opened that new mine, I might get a promotion. You'll be right. The government won't stop it. This uh, wind and solar thing won't last. Too unreliable. Inshallah. How's the project going? It's going really well, actually. Lots of scientists on board. I'm positive we can reduce our dependence on coal and gas drastically. We need to eliminate that crap, not just reduce. Too many people focusing on reducing. It makes me mad. We need to eliminate coal altogether and we need to do it now. I agree, but let's be realistic. We have to do it progressively. I mean, you still play your PlayStation, right? Yeah, but I have solar panels. And if I could put a wind farm in my backyard, I'd do that too. Yes, but you're not ready to quit it altogether, right? Fine. Good point, but I do make a living streaming. Samir. Mama. I must talk to you immediately. Lord Alia has brought shame to the shame. family. What are you talking about? Our daughter is a respectful girl. She'd never do anything to shame us. Then explain to me the tattoo on her forearm. Ali doesn't have any tattoo. Saw it myself. It's disgraceful. You should be paying more attention to what your children are doing. And this research project she's working on could bring an end to all mining. Please don't make a scene. Let us go home. We'll talk about what to do later. Come on. So what are you going to say to her? I don't know. I think you should wait until tomorrow. I can't wait. I don't want the two of you fighting on Eid. I need to know the truth. Tell Dad that your research project is trying to put the company he works for out of business. I'm going to do it today, but I think I'm going to wait till after dinner. I don't want Dad to think it's an attack on him. Why should you my tattoo? It's beautiful. <laughs> oh my god, you're <laughs> going to kill I, them. I'm not going to tell them about the tattoo, but I do need to speak to Dad about the research project. I don't want him finding out from anyone else. Sure. I just want mum to be there to protect you. No, I just don't want to be disowned by dad and the whole family. That's all.
Alia. Show me your arm. What? Why? You know very well why. Show me. You've brought shame to your family. And you disrespect me and my life's work. Explain to me this big project that you're doing. It's going to put an end to all mining. With all due respect, Dad, you know the company you work for is destroying the planet. That company put food on the table, paid for your clothes, books, games, and now is putting you through uni. Yes, but I didn't ask for that. You should have left a long time ago. I don't know why you still work there. There are plenty of other jobs. Plenty of other jobs? They hired me when no one else would. When everyone else turned me away because of my religion. They gave me a chance. Plenty of jobs. You kids, you're so spoilt. You think everything is easy because we gave you too much. Stop it. Can we all please stop arguing not today? Just can we please all calm down and have a nice sleep? <sighs> Oh, my brother, how proud I am of my smart daughter going to university, working on a big project. And then he tells me about that damn tattoo and that damn project. You should be proud, Dad. Oh, I'm finding a way to help save this planet. So what is the big project, Alia? Please tell us. I'm sure your uncle's just trying to stir up trouble. Well... It's actually very interesting. I'm very excited to be a part of. We're working on finding a solution for our energy needs. And it's not just solar or uh, water. It's, um, we're, we're trying to find a way to stop using coal altogether. So you do want to put me out of work? Who will pay for you to keep studying? to destroy your family's lives. What about your sister? Dad, relax. I'm sure the government is going to approve that new mine project you've been working for. Even though I really hope they don't. You better hope they do. Otherwise, you can quit school. I can look after myself. You can quit school and go and get a job for the first time in your life. I already have a part-time job. Good. Then you no longer need my money. Or that new car that we got you for your birthday. Give me the keys and get out. You can bus back to university. Or better still, you can walk. You don't want those bus fumes killing the planet. I need my jacket. It's in the car. Dad? Alia. Yes. Sit down. It's been gone a while. When we should be coming home again. Later on in the year, when university finishes. And um, is she still coming to work with you? She certainly will. She'll be working in the renewable energy department.
Inchi, you're walking into a shop now. You just walk into a shop very early. Thank <laughs> you.